and welcome to the show. Today we leave Darwin and make a beeline for Catherine. Ah, yes, this convoy is going to float with the butterflies but sting like a bee. Oh, that's deep. What do you actually mean, though? You're going to have to find out. Stick around, folks, while we show you... What's, what's up, up Down, down Under? under? We were on our way, and since the drive to Catherine was more than 300 kilometres, we decided to look for a nice place to stop, have lunch, and a little rest. We'd been driving for a while and red everywhere, but this little oasis popped out of nowhere. We were in Bachelor, and we found a butterfly place in the middle of nowhere. Not only did we find the Bachelor Butterfly Farm, we also found one of our lost convoy members who eluded us whilst in Darwin. Ah, a little gnome. Or is it a Buddha? It's a garden Buddha. <laughs> You've got to rub its head three times for a One, wish. two, I three. wish it was Mecca. <laughs> <laughs> How you oh, going, guys? I was just hanging, mwah, hanging with the Flutter Boys. <laughs> well, welcome back, man. <laughs> Thanks for having me back. Of all the places we thought we'd Come, find him. get up here. <laughs> Just one highlight of the Bachelor Butterfly Farm is the enclosure where you stroll through and view a variety of common and rare species. The owner Chris, who is quite a character, has created this oasis of natural beauty. As you can see, like, this one's quite happy. Everything that they had on the menu it was all out of the garden. We watched them go and hand pick the salad and the vegetables and, and whip it all up and it was a sensational meal.